So Maciek, uh, I know there have been some questions in your talk, some of them related to the modules in Java 9, which are the pros and cons about, of, of them? So the biggest benefit and pro of, of having modules in Java 9 is that they will be embedded in the JDK itself, so they will have great adoption, great tooling, and it would be easy to get them. The biggest cons are, the first one, is that they are no here, not here yet and they won't be here for two months or two years, who knows. And the second one is that they suffer from some design decisions, mostly dealing with the simplicity of their usage and the fact that were, they were designed more to, mm, I would say, to modularize the JDK itself and not to enable us developers use the JDK modules to use in our applications. Mm -hmm. And my second question is, uh, when to use services over microservices? Well, I believe that you, if you have smaller application yeah. and you don't have, or if you don't have proper DevOps, for example, you are embedded in some enterprise culture with firm separation of the development operations, you shouldn't pursue microservices, you should look to modularize your code in different ways. For example, using Java modules, SGI and stuff like that. If not, you can pursue microservices, although in, it involves many trade-offs and overheads, especially operational one. Okay, thank you for your time, Matek. Thank you.